In today's lesson, we're going to talk about how to multiply a whole number by a decimal. So let's start with the first example. What is 7 times 0.8? So I'm going to write it this way, 0.8 times 7. Since the first number has only one digit, I like to put that on the bottom. So this is only going to give me one row instead of two rows. 8 times 7 is 56. We can write the 6, carry over the 5. 7 times 0 is 0 plus 5. We get 5. Now, notice that we only have one digit to the right of the decimal point. So our answer is going to have one digit to the right of the decimal point. Therefore, the answer is going to be 5.6. For the second example, we have 8 times 0.35. So I'm going to write it this way, 0.35 times 8. Putting the 8 on the bottom is going to make the problem a lot easier. 8 times 5 is 40. So I'm going to write the 0, carry over the 4. And then 8 times 3 is 24 plus 4, that's 28. I'm going to write the 8, carry over the 2. 8 times 0 is 0 plus 2, that's going to be 2. Now, notice that we have only two digits to the right of the decimal point. So we're going to have two digits to the right of the decimal point as well. So we're going to put the decimal point here. Therefore, the answer is going to be 2.8 or 2.80. So that's how you can multiply a whole number by a decimal and get the right answer at the same time. 